Wait, is that Mexico over there? That's not Mexico over there, is it? I'm sorry, I thought that was Mexico just here. It's not the forts there. Oh my god. I just ready. Boom! Dude, these guys got no hope. They, they think they're getting me because I'm on a raft. You don't have hope. What are you hoping for? Nothing. You're going down. You're dead. You're actually now dead. Oh, where they come? Up there? I see. Oh, shit. Dude, he's chuck a pedal bomb at me. Hey, get the horse. Go, go, go. Dude, what a, what a mission. Come on, come on, come on. Got him. Got him. Right over there. Come on, dude. Reload. Oh, I got him. I got him. I got him. Don't worry. We made it. Thank the Lord. Dude, I'm just saying, there's no way this is Mexico. I could literally run here quicker than that. I don't understand what he's on about. How, how is this Mexico? My house is here. This is where I actually live. I could have swam this quicker than that. Dude, I have no clue what's going on here. Oh, wait, this is my house. I just killed a man. Oh, I didn't. This is funny. Dude, kill him. <laughs> what harm? could you do to us exactly kill him now <laughs> please kill him john john just kill him you're dead you're so freaking dead as you wish <laughs> yes go on john hit go on that's it take off the hat then then shoot him there we go what a great way to improve border relations an angry man a long way from home. A man who handles a gun as sloppy as you. I can handle a gun okay, partner. Okay. Look at everybody screaming because I just shot the birds. Dude, look at that dog. No innocents need to die today, partner. Apart from the dog. I can't believe Mexico is literally just over the way. Boom. Just do it for the lols. And he's dead. Oh my god, dude, get up! Javier Escuela? Emilio, let me ask you something. His nombre is Javier, Senor Escuela, is Javier to see? No se, Senor. <sighs> he doesn't know. But they do have his sister. Emilio's, I mean. She's a fine young woman, a teacher, a human being, not the clothed vermin so many people seem to have turned into. Tell him I'm sorry. When a man's family is involved, you need a little more enthusiasm than mere apologies. I have enough worries, sir. This man's problems pain me, but they're not quite my own. Those who sit on the fence make a choice in their own way. Don't you think, Mr. Marston? Of course. And what about you, Ricketts? A man living in the past? A man who ran away from home? What choice did you make? I'll tell you what choice I made. I'm a fighter, sir. And I'll fight to the end. I think we should get going. Blood the hell. This guy's so intense, isn't he? Take a seat on the train. Dude, this train is scummy. Look at it. Rats wouldn't live here. Is that the old Bill? Dude, that's the old Bill. Hey, Hold on. Did we take the shot? Dude, I got the shot. I, I can do it. Well, I say we've waited long enough. All right, run. Come on, let's get into those caves. I'm in. I'm coming. Do something or we're all gonna die in here. Oh, there's no one there. There was no one there. Got him. Got him. Don't worry about me, mate. Don't worry about me. I got this. Reload. I don't need to stay with you, dude. I'm all about this. I'm all about this. Is this what I live for? This is what I live for. This one's dead. Move. Follow me. Oh shit! A shotgun. Looks like we might need a little dynamite to get it open. That's what I'm talking about. Get out of it, scrubs. Get behind the table. I'm gonna blow it. 
I'm coming back. Hold on. Stand back, damn it. Here goes. Come on, boy. Poor girl's barely alive. Right, let's see if we can all get out of here in one. Move. I got this. I got this. I'm all about this. Dude, I've killed them all. Just go. Dude. Run. What are you doing? Are you coming? Oh, here he comes. Full speed. Full freaking speed. Taking you all out. All right, boys. Boom. Was someone named Harvey Esquela one of the men holding you? No. I don't know. I don't think so. But I remember that name from prison. Bad people spoke of him. I told you, John, he's still in Mexico. Okay, then. I guess we'll keep looking. Uh, yeah. You fucking cheat! Excuse me? You fucking looked in my fucking carts, you fucking cheat! Now, Herr Muller, let's calm down. There must be some mistake. There's no mistake. Your Yankee friend here is a fucking cheat. Easy there, Germany. Calm yourself down. Oh, yeah. You know exactly what you did. Yeah, I know exactly what I did, friend, which was nothing. Now, I'd prefer it if we could all play a friendly game and no one get hurt. You, you planted this guy, Ricketts. Now, why would I do that? I've already beaten you. Now, calm down and let's finish the game. There's no, no more cards game. Ease up there, friend. There must be a name for this. An impasse, sir. An impasse. We could all die here and now. <laughs> that guy didn't have a chance. I didn't even know what I was doing when I killed him. You, uh, the man like Marston, see? Uh, you like killing? Watch me cut her throat. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> oh my god, I didn't actually think I was going to do that! Oh my god! Have some of that, Scrubs! Have some of that! Boom! Come here, I ain't even scared of you. Boom! Where's your mate? Where's your mate? Boom! You tourists certainly bring peace and prosperity to this land. Teabag. The 2010 teabag. Any word of Javier Escuela? No. And yet, say, why are you after him anyway? We're old friends. We was kind of educated together. <laughs> so what is this, some kind of high school reunion sort of thing? Something like that. Well, well you've killed people. You lived the life. <sighs> that I have. And I tried to stop. I mean, I don't know. I tried to go straight. I did. I left the gang after the gang left me. Left me to die after I'd been shot. They'd all gone crazy anyhow. Hey, what? Our old leader, fella you probably heard of. Anyway, he more or less lost his mind, went and shot a bunch of people unfair like. I got shot in a robbery. Oh, yeah, yeah, we did. They left me, and I left them. <laughs> well, that's how it goes. Hey, hold on. Arthur saved you, mate. You're not going to talk about Arthur? We're calling this horse Tesco as well. Come on. You can still be a father. No, not now. Not at his age, mate. Dude's like 70. By the time the kid's two, he'll be dead. Oh, sh Hold on. What's this? Army. Okay. Ah. Oh. oh, shit, dude. Help. Oh. Boom. Boom in the face. I'm dead! What the hell is this crap? I killed 50 of them! Poxy puck bloody game. Hey, old man, I'm saying you better start doing some work or I'm going to kneecap you. You ain't going to be surviving until tomorrow if you don't bloody hell. How am I dead again? Later that night. Take him out. Look, they're headshots. They must die. Come on. Look, I'm moving. I'm moving. I'm moving.
Okay, get that guy. Get that guy. Get that one. Come on. Shoot! For the love of God, man. I right, move. Did I get him? <gasps> Let's fucking go! Are you been sitting up there this entire time? Now uh, we'll handle it from here. I know you got other matters to attend to. It's been nice riding with you, Mr. Ricketts. <laughs> and you too. You took me back to another time. Talk to Louisa. She'll help you, and she's well connected in that other land. I hope you find what you're looking for, Marston. You know what I'm looking for. Mr. Bill. I got people to see, my dude. We're gonna go this way. And we're gonna go and see this dude. You come to my country. My poor little country. And you think you can be friends with the president? Oh, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Things must have come out wrong. Maybe you can help me. You'll be sorry, friend. <laughs> relax! I mean, relax! <laughs> sure. Somewhere between a threatening stare and the soldier's arm to the teeth. Yeah. Yeah, you had me. Welcome to Mexico, amigo! Let's come me drink. And then we'll talk. My name is Capitan Vicente de Santa. John Marston. My country is in pain, John Marston. Terrible pain. The rebels have seized the people by the throat and destroyed a way of life. I'm no politician, sir. And I am uh, no soldier, Aquila. Mm -hmm. But we are both beholding to our time. A brave man. Perhaps you've heard of him. Coronel Alande. He's trying to preserve the order in our province. To keep our civilization alive. It is tough. The people are confused and usually swayed. Sometimes in the service of what is right, you gotta do terrible things. <laughs> it breaks my heart. I also am no moralist, sir. I wish I enjoy your freedoms, Mr. Marston. I'm trying to find a man, an American, an outlaw named Bill Williamson. I believe he came here to seek protection from another outlaw named Javier Escuela. You're no moralist, but you hunt outlaws? So it would seem. You heard anything of these men? I am the government, or what is left of it. Outlaws seek each other. They're possibly hiding with thieves and killers who pose as freedom fighters in the hills around here. They're united under one traitor named Abraham Reyes. Where could I find this Reyes? If I knew, I would be there, hunting him with everything that is true within me. Reyes finds you. Like cholera. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> but it's possible, though. My men are trying to lure him into a trap. Possibly you could ride with us. And if everything goes okay, I'm sure the coronel will help you. Okay. It's not for now. Are you ready? Ready for what? We will lure the rebels into a trap. There's a train leaving to Parosa soon. We're going to escort it. They will think okay. it's a supply train. We're going to trap him, eh? There are no supplies on it. Very clever. We must throw the rats out of their holes. Give them some bait they can reduce. They, they have to have, like, dynamite or TNT or something in here, right? Yep. Come on. Oh, shit! What do you mean, do it on foot? They just TNT'd me! That was insane! Oh, how do I reload? Oh, no! Get back on the horse! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! That's, that's the man who helped us defeat Reyes. The man I spoke to you of? 
Uh, Frendo, Mexico. Hello, sir. Hola, gringo. So you are the bounty hunter, huh? Have you found your prey yet? No, sir. Ah, perhaps you come to hunt me, huh? Your country loves to make trouble in mine. Perhaps, but it isn't so. Ah, perhaps I should tie you to a horse and let it drag you around town. Or let the dogs fight you, huh? <laughs> then see what you say. I'd say the same thing. I'm here to bring two men to justice, nothing more. Your politics or ideas of entertainment are not my concern. Yeah, I suppose not. Pero son tuyos. Sinceramente, espero que me encontraste alguna compañía más interesante que esa bruja que me traíste anoche. Let me ask you this, sir. Do you know anything of the men I'm looking for? Escuela is from this province. His uh, father was a borracho, a drunk who worked as a laborer on land cultivated by my uncle. Men like that are natural allies for Reyes. My people have lived and worked here for a hundred years. We brought civilization. And these people, these fucking monkeys, despise us. We brought them God! And they turned their back on him. Now I fight to help them from themselves, to save them from themselves. I see in their faces that they would kill me if they could. <laughs> they see only a tyrant. That is the way it is. These people need a ruler. Well, sorry to hear that. Sorry? Why <laughs> be sorry? It is a way of mankind, a fight between two forces, que sera, sera, what will be, will be. But I know one thing, Senor Marston. Force, <laughs> force must be used if you are to have your own way. I'm sure. Now, perhaps you can uh, do me a favor while I find these men for you. After we find the men, then I'll help in any way I can. Ah, that, 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 that. You are in no position to negotiate. Now, por favor, a bunch of these idiots men are fighting at Tesoro Azul. Now, you head there and you lend your support. <sighs> Baboso, ¿cuántas veces voy a decirte? No ponga detrás de mí. ¿Qué eres, cabrón? You Americans think you can ride? Do you? Come on, I will race you there. Okay. Oh, dude. Is he actually going to keep up, or what's he doing? Stalling? Is he going to cheat? Is he? What's he doing? If I run round here, oh, oh no, I've got that glitch. Hold on, uh, that way. Okay. There are fire bottles over there. Use them to burn down some of these houses. For that one. Um, boom. Um, loot body. Hey, stop looting the body. That's mine. Get out of here. That's what I'm. You, you dirty tramp. Did you just think my ammo? I'll kill you. Come on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna petrol bomb you. Right, mm. Uh huh. <laughs> Lucky scrub. What you gonna do? Anybody about? Anybody about? Anybody actually see that? He's not dead. Have some more. Hey, yeah, he's dead. Right, Nick is ammo. My apologies, mister. Dude, he didn't even nick the ammo. <gasps> My bad. Right, with the invention of time travel, we're going to the place that we need to be. Jesus Christ, man. You need to stay off that crack. What are you on about? Hey, Caron, let me in. Come back between 7 and 10 p.m. Caron. What is the time? Purchase for 150 quid. What this crap? Oh, what, dude, I ain't purchasing. I'm not having this. This is horrible. Look at this. This is crappy ass. Nah, oh, I'm about that life. Now, that one's got a forge. So maybe we take that house instead. Oh, my God. That guy just died. Come on. Come on. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Dude, go faster. Let's see 
What the hell was that? Oh my god. We've got a freaking sniper rifle. Look at that. Right, where are they? Okay, up there. Pop to the air. That's Hector out of Fast and Furious. Dude, I need this in my life. I need to keep this. Move out of the way. You're all freaking slow. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'll show you who's no bloody use, mate. You got no hope. You, you said I ain't got nothing. You said I ain't got nothing. You said I'm no one. I'm showing you who's you are, bloody am. Don't even care. I'll take all of them. Dude, oh my God. I'm, I'm all about this now. I'm running. I'm not even stopping. Yeah, I'm killing them all. Like you uh, deserve fine women and wine. The best pleasures earth can give a man. <laughs> I need some information, DeSanta. All in good time. <laughs> uh, my man and I will finish our business here and we can talk back at Escalera. The next time I see you, I need some answers. Captain. <laughs> Go get the Hi, Javi, is not here? Enjoy life! Oh. It's a beautiful struggle! <laughs> Dude, I was well excited. This is the president, right? I ain't scared no freaking president. Oi, president! Tell me where they are, or I'm petrol bombing you after I've got my horse unstuck. Dude, I can see us really uh, killing all of these. I really can. <laughs> <laughs> the two patriots were keen to make your acquaintance, the ah, coronel. Fantastic. I love patriots. Hey, <laughs> ah, Sergeant Marston, you here to fight the war? And we shall make a patriot of you yet. I hope so. <laughs> Any word of those men? Oh, yes. I heard they were riding with Reyes. I wanted to talk to you about it. Uh, the Santo, uh, hable con él. Tell him what I wanted. Huh? His Excellency, El Coronel, would like to employ you in escorting a train down rebel country. The job is dangerous, but you'll have the honor of... <laughs> Another patriot? Of knowing that you said Mexico in her fight against forces that would destroy our society. How much you offer? 20,000 pesos. And information as to the whereabouts of Javier Escuella. <laughs> okay, then. Mexico loves you, Mr. Martin. She has a funny way of showing it. <laughs> Dude, I'm not really liking this. Every single time we come here, we've got to go and do something for this stupid president. I'm going to bop him. I think what we should do is uh, when we come back, I'm going to start petrol bombing him. Dude, who are these rebels anyway? Are they just people who don't like the president? Maybe we join the rebels. Maybe we join the rebels, dude. I'm all about this. I'll be oi, rebel, oi, don't die. I'll kill this guy if you take me to your mate. Oh man, twenty thousand pesos is two dollars. What do you mean it's two dollars? Why, why would, we, why are we doing all this for two dollars? That's nothing. I find two dollars on the floor, dude. I'm getting ripped off. Dude, they're scamming me. Really? I can't believe they're bloody scamming me. Captain, you're freaking scamming me. Two dollars? Seriously? Find two dollars on the floor. Give me my two dollars. <laughs> he fell over. Come on. Yeah, yeah, I got it, dude. I got it, I got it, I got it. Don't worry. Oh, that's it, boys. This time I've got ammo. You I have no hope. Here they come. Go on, take out the horse. I'm not even killing them. I'm taking out the horse. Dude, you can get on this train as much as you want. It's a death sentence. Right, I think that's it. I think I killed everybody on the train. I right, got you, got you. Another one dead. Dude, we're literally wiping out the whole culture of rebels in Mexico. There's none of them left. Look, they're just coming here to die. Suicide by Gatling gun. Oh, there's another one. Oh, another one coming. There we go. Another one. I, I feel sorry for the horses, mate. I do. Senor Marston, thank you for your efforts. The escort was a success. At least some of your men survived. I didn't think to survive myself. My whole life I have dreamed of a glorious death. 
Vamos. Rápido antes uh, que nos ataquen otra vez. These socialist pigs cannot be allowed to win. If you enjoyed this video, go and check out one of these videos because you're probably going to enjoy that as well. Don't forget to subscribe and have an amazing day.